Good morning. I'm Tom, aka Jackknife, and I'm continuing on with my gameplay of Firewatch. This is part four. No, it's part five, sorry. Part five. Anyways, let's go. I supposed to do? Fishing below. Oh, wait, I'm fishing. <laughs> Good. I'm pointing this way, so I'm assuming I'm going this way. I don't know where I am. Yeah, I've walked around here enough. I go over here and I'll end up by the riverbed. I haven't yet quite figured out this game. Like, from a, um, uh, level of action kind of standpoint. Like, how intense does this game get? I have no idea. It hasn't gotten exactly intense so far, but hey, I got sworn on it by a couple of girls. Someone left their clipboard out here. Huh. It could have been one of the fish and game folks. See if there's a name or a credential or something. I can call it in. What? The, uh, it's... Holy shit. What's going on? You didn't actually find a bear, did you? Someone has written down what we said to each other, have been saying. That doesn't make any sense. Uh, I don't talk to the other lookouts as much as I talk to you, not in the same way. No way. Wait, hold on. Something's out here. find and eat any mushrooms, did you? I mean, they can be fun, but also, you know, devastating. Regardless, just let me know, okay, buckaroo? Oh god, I don't know why I just called you that. Oh. All right, I guess shit happens. Jeez. What happened, Henry? I. I just I got hit in the head, punched or something by someone. Are you serious? What the hell is going on out there? I don't know. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Let me get this straight. You found a clipboard with. What? Transcripts of our conversations? What else is on it? I don't know. It's gone. Along with a radio of theirs. Somebody out here could have just killed me, Delilah. <sighs> I don't... What the fuck is going on? What's Wapiti Station? I I, I... I... I don't know. I saw the name Wapiti Station right before I was cold cocked. Does Wapiti Station mean anything to you? Uh... Wapiti Meadow. Maybe it's Wapiti Meadow. It's, it's on our maps. It's not too far from where you are right now. It's where you saw that damn fence. It's north of the lake. It, it looks like there should be a trail somewhere on the north shore of Jonesy Lake. I'll, uh, I'll start hiking that way now. God damn it, my head. Are you, are you sure you saw what, what you saw, Henry? Maybe you pissed off some more campers and they came back to sucker punch you. Oh, this just seems like 
a, like a misunderstanding or something. Look, I know what I saw. Hey, it was our words with initials for our names, H and D, clear as day. And you've been feeling okay? I feel fine. Okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I, I believe you, but that conversation was from two weeks ago. I know they were. So what's to say that they don't have transcripts from three, four, or five weeks ago? Our entire relationship, friendship, our, our whole summer. Someone is out here with the walkie-talkie taking notes and talking to God knows who. Look, I could hike over there and look around, but I won't be able to get through the fence. How do you know? I already tried months ago when I was out there hiking. <sighs> Curiosity got the best of you, huh? Rightfully so, in hindsight. Well, shit. I could spend all day banging on it and see, I guess. Hey, actually, those guys doing the control burn, they might be able to help. Where are they? Beyond Ruby River, there's a scout camp. They burned a line a few days ago that should let you hike right to them. Well, that's great. If they haven't left, they're probably the type of guys who would help you get through that fence. What? Where's Ruby River? Oh, for crying out loud. Really? Good thing this isn't real walking. Hmm. Probably thinner if it was. It's not because it's not actually as far as it feels. Yeah. So I think I need to go. I need to go that way. So I need to go east. Little Thunder Canyon along. Or no. I need to go. It's going south. From there. Okay, let's just switch up. I'm getting busy. So. There's a tree coming up behind me. Okay, so I want to go east. I need to look up and see if he's staring at me. called a 
around, things seem normal with everyone else. Has anything strange been happening on your end? No, nothing really. Nothing really or nothing? Nothing. My door was open the other night, but that's not strange. That doesn't sound like nothing. It's nothing, I promise. All right, I'm headed toward the camp anyway. Okay. Keep your radio close to you. Hey, what you just said, keep my radio close to me. Yeah? Before I got attacked back at the lake, I saw a radio on the ground. Kind of like the one I use. And? Do you think that maybe someone was, you know, uh... I don't know. What? Maybe intercepting our frequency with other radios or something. Henry... It's just a thought. I, I don't even know how you would do that. Yeah, well, you sound worried. No, I'm not. Okay, let's not spin out of control. Just keep hiking. Whatever you say, boss. I'm just more surprised he hasn't run into bears. Or cheetahs, or mountain lions, or whatever. I think that's what stops me from hiking. Alone. Oh, I don't want to go through here. You just know that this is a bad idea. Where am I? I need to go. It's out the river over. God damn. Alright, fine. So, you can put the thing, wibble down, get past song. Is there anything in here? Oh, I'm gonna get a bad time in here. I'm scared now. his dad to protect him. Ned, right? Yeah. You don't think he could? No, you're you're probably right. It, it was three years ago. He's in high school now. He's on summer break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You mean this way? I'm going this way. I'm going this way because. Hold on. Am I going? No, it doesn't really matter, I think. Yeah, both are the same. Okay. okay. I'm going south. That's all that matters. It can be south, right? Yeah, so I can go this way. It's clear. This 
Sorry. So now I'm all nervous. It's just clearly a creep hanging around. I don't know what he's trying to do. I'm kind of glad I don't know anything about this game, other than one, the one ad I saw. Because I kind of don't want to know. So it tells me that the... Oh, I right. That the not knowing can make the story better. I just feel like I'm sipping off a wind through the top. Why not? Oh, my generator's still running, that's nice. Well, the June fire isn't going anywhere, huh? No, that's why those guys came out to burn that line. It's at the stage where all we can do is pay attention to it. They're not gonna try to put it out? Not yet, apparently. <laughs> Been this way before. So I don't think I have. I think this is all new to me. Take a picture of that. My home would be there, except there's trees in the way. I have 17 pictures, something tells me I. Oh no, okay. Just come this way. I can walk around it, which is what I'm going to do. Physical activity, jumping. I found a turtle. Maybe it's a, a tortoise. It's a thing with a shell. Well, isn't that something? It's actually pretty cute. Well, Henry, if you decide you want it to keep you company, nobody will mind. Now, what do I call it? Looks like a, uh, hmm. Oh, this ought to be good. Turt Reynolds. <laughs> <laughs> well, now I can't wait to see him. The mustache is impressive. You tell him I love Cannonball Run. Uh, whoa, Delilah, the trail I hiked in on, it's, it's, uh, it's gone. What is this, the Twilight Zone? It's starting to feel like it. Well, look, don't freak, okay? This happens. At the end of the summer, we just fly you out. Or, you know, if there's an emergency. I'm sensing an emergency. I can't 
call and ask for a $15,000 helicopter ride because there might be someone out here harassing us. Well, let me know when you can, okay? Okay, Henry. Oh, what else? Yeah, there we go. So I need to go south. Let's go that way. I can go the wrong way anyways. Alright, here we go. I was thinking about going in the first place. Can we go that way? Go this way. Now, well, since my finger has already, already decided that I'm going this way, then I'm going this way. Except, oh yeah, okay. Alright. Oh, yeah. uh, I crossed. On those rocks. So these guys Ron and Dave they're leaving notes for each other in the boxes is there any chance that they had anything to do with those girls disappearing no they're both Rangers they're not out here this season I didn't really know them that well but I always assumed the only thing Ron cared about was chasing tail and getting loaded it's somehow comforting to know that he was able to keep up a correspondence with someone who wasn't going to send him a topless Polaroid I didn't ever Where they did the controlled burn. I can hike right through here now. Yeah, normally they wouldn't do that so close to a body of water, but I think they're extra worried about a fire jumping the river and burning up to two forks now that there's someone in it. Well, I'm extra appreciative of that. Let's see. The scout camp is southeast of the river. There should be a pond on the way. Got it. What happens if a controlled burn gets out of control? Someone gets fired. Are you serious? Oh, come on. That one was an honest accident. I'm not even in the mood for wordplay. That's how wound up all this shit has me. There's some old snowmobiles out here. That's crazy. Looks like one of the poor bastards was cruising across this pond and dumped it. That was not a fun hike back to civilization. Whoa. Someone stripped these snowmobiles down to the bone. Huh. I and mean, that's weird, right? I mean, I can come up with a bunch of not weird reasons someone would do that out here, but given what's happened, yeah. Yeah, that's weird. Uh, 
Uh, there's an old pond out here, not much more than a pile of mud. Uh, do, do you have it on your map? Ah, uh, yeah, I know where you are. Yeah? Where am I? Fort Pond. There used to be a sign up for it, but, um, well, folks kept stealing it. Uh, because it's called Pork Pond? It's a good goddamn name. That sign would look great in a den, or, you know, anywhere. I keep hearing noises, but I think it's me. Okay, so I need to be going east. Alright, we're going right on. Probably can't run. Oh, I can. Can. Arapaho. The bridge to the camp is out. I'm going to walk the ravine and see if I can find some high ground to get across. Good plan. Camp Arapaho. You're there? Yeah, I am. <sighs> it's been out there since the 50s. I was never really into the idea of the scouts. It's something about men organizing boys around their ideals. Never sat right with me. Beware weebelos in large numbers. I'm still looking for a way across the ravine. Well, there must be one. I mean, the firefighters made it from that camp to Ruby River. This isn't going to be like Friday the 13th, right? You ever talked to any of the scouts? Mm, no, they haven't been out here in a while, and I generally don't have a lot to say to preteens. Unless it's Brian Goodwin. Well, if forced, I mean, I can make conversation with anyone. Plus, it was sort of fun to hear about all of his nerdy hobbies. What type of nerdy hobbies are we talking about with him? Like, a marching band? Oh, no, 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 no. Like comics, model rockets, wizards and wyverns, you know. Oh. Hey, thanks to Brian, I can almost recall by memory the armor classes of most dragons. The what? No, you can't. Hey, planar dragons armor class. Let's see. Okay, no, I believe you. We're good. We're good. Uh, I guess these little shelters are where they keep the weeblos. For the past 35 years, yeah. Yeah, these guys are gone. Found where they were sitting around before getting picked up. Damn. Uh, I found an axe. If one of the crew left it, that thing is actually called a Pulaski. It looks like an axe to me. This thing will be a huge help. For both getting through the backcountry and getting through that fence. Hey, Dee, they left something behind. It's like a memo from their boss. Did it say anything of note? Hmm. Huh. Uh, next few days, dropping into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would meet someone to give me a taste of my own medicine. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching?
Oh, you know, probably just horned toads. Maybe Turk was an escapee. And a Wapiti Station clipboard with our conversations on it is just, what, recreation for them? I'm just messing around. Somebody is obviously up to something. I'm freaking out here. At least we know there is something real happening behind that fence. I think that we should consider that maybe this is all just a coincidence, but my gut says that there is something bad going on. Mine too. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you. All right, I'm going to stop here and carry on in a moment with a separate file. Stay tuned for part five. Mm -hmm.